USA Today reports that a new study has revealed that an herbicide that contaminates the tap water consumed by millions of Americans has been found to produce gender-bending effects in male frogs, chemically castrating some and turning others into females. The Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences released the study this past week, and researcher Tyrone Hayes of the University of California, Berkeley, says frogs in the experiment were exposed to amounts of the weed killer atrazine that are comparable to the levels allowed in drinking water by the Environmental Protection Agency. In Hayes' earlier studies, atrazine caused male frogs to begin growing eggs in their testes. In this experiment, 10% of the males exposed to atrazine, one of the most commonly used herbicides in the world, actually changed sex. Some were able to breed and lay eggs. Hayes says nearly all of the other males had low testosterone and sperm levels, which made them unable to reproduce. He says the experiment can't tell scientists whether atrazine affects humans in a similar way. But it does raise new questions about the safety of atrazine, which other studies have linked to human birth defects, low birth weight, prematurity, and low sperm count. The APA said last October that it planned to reassess atrazine's safety, including its cancer risk. The European Union has banned the chemical. According to the U.S. Geological Survey, about 75% of streamwater samples and 40% of groundwater samples contain atrazine. The Natural Resources Defense Council, an environmental advocacy group, detected atrazine in 90% of tap water samples from 139 water systems.